And the aroma of these wonderful things that Nancy has brought here with us, it's engulfing me. So I'm going to quit talking <laughs> and introduce you to Nancy. Nancy Stein is our, I love it how she signed it, our, wait a minute. You are our um, culinary chef, culinary chef, chef extraordinaire. <laughs> Good morning, Nancy. Good morning, Franco. And what have you brought here? Well, today we're going to do a very simple recipe that's a powerhouse of nutrition. It's going to uh, be a mock tuna. And we at Whole Foods for Healthy Living, we teach plant-based nutrition. So what we believe is that this is the healthiest diet one person can be on. Um, we use no meat, fish, dairy, or eggs in our cooking classes. Uh, we um, provide all our nutrition, our powerhouse of food, with beans and grains and uh, vegetables and fruits and nuts and seeds. And it just transforms your life. So today we're just going to do a really quick recipe. Um, after the show, everyone's welcome to come down and taste test this recipe. Um, it is mock tuna, and of course we're making this without tuna. So let's get started. Oh um, my goodness, okay. We, we need to open the... Uh, uh, no, those I, I have it all situated here. You do? I, I do want to show you that what we use are going to be garbanzo beans, um, also known as chickpeas. And you'll just use a can of this. And it's always important um, to uh, drain the beans from the can. And I also like to rinse them in a little bit of uh, cold water. And it is organic, folks. Yeah, it's organic. Um, you know, I, we do stress organic in Whole Foods uh, cooking. Um, however, there's, you know, an expense uh, for many people. And so it's, you know, my philosophy is to always eat beans um, you know, eat your fruits and vegetables, and if you can't buy organic, if it's too expensive for you, then I suggest that you at least buy conventional, the closest to home. And uh, again, this is our garbanzo beans. Now, I've well, already... What you have done to those? Well, the garbanzo beans, you do not have to cook them. Like I said, just drain and rinse them. And I have uh, put them into a food processor just to uh, make it the consistency of like a crumbled tuna. And what you want to do, you can also use a potato masher to do this. You can just simply use a fork to do this. Uh, so we're just going to use our one can of garbanzo beans in here. And then we're going to add about a third of a cup of uh, celery, just like you would make really any tuna. So we're going to add some of that in, maybe just a little more, because I like a lot of celery. And then we're going to use, now here in the onions, you can use any onion you prefer. I just happen to like red onions in this type of a dish. However, you can use, um, you know, shallots, you can use green onions, you can use yellow. It's whatever, um, you know, onion that you like. And then, of course, um, you know, relish always comes in, in the store and it has high fructose corn syrup. Of course, we um, like to discourage any products especially processed foods, um, because we are whole foods. And so we do not recommend products that have high fructose corn syrup, products that have hydrogenated oils or partially hydrogenated oils, um, because they clog the arteries of your heart. And they're just not good. It causes obesity. It causes heart disease. And um, so we try to avoid all of that. So all I've done is taken one dill pickle and just finely chopped it. And so we're using fresh dill pickles. And of course, this little recipe doesn't look like much, but this is a powerhouse of protein, high protein, um, high fiber. Uh, it also has um, all your vitamins, your minerals, your amino acids, because we're also going to be adding a little bit of kelp powder, which is um, a seaweed. And this is going to give us all of our essential minerals. And I'm just going to sprinkle some on here. And of course, this kind of gives us our little tuna thing going on. Okay, another product we're going to be using is called nutritional yeast. 
nutritional yeast is, um, has a cheesy flavor. It's different than uh, brewer's yeast, which is like what you find in beer. This is nutritional yeast. It's very high in the B vitamins, especially B12, and we use this a lot in vegan cooking. And we're going to use, let's see, about a half a tablespoon of this. And this is going to impart a lot of flavor in our tuna today. And we're going to use one teaspoon of soy sauce. And again, I use Bragg's. This happens to be gluten-free. You can use any soy sauce. Um, we do, again, like to have you use a, a healthy one, like tamari, um, organic soy sauce. And so we're just going to put a teaspoon of that in here. And I know you're all thinking, how could this possibly taste anything like a tuna? But you're going to be pleasantly surprised. And we added our uh, kelp powder, so we're going to add about a fourth of a cup of mayonnaise. And of course, our mayonnaise is by Follow Your Heart, and it is completely dairy-free and egg-free because, again, we, we believe that um, dairy is, um, it causes illness and disease, and we do not use it in our cooking. So we're going to add about, um, we're going to start out with about a fourth of a cup of this. Let me just get that pickle off there. And you can always add as we go along here, but we just don't want to get too much mayonnaise in here. So again, this is just real simple. And what we try to teach is that everything that we, we try to have you rethink the way you're eating. That every time you go to put something in your mouth, that you're actually thinking about the nutritional value of it. And, and, you know, over the years, everybody's forgotten this, so that they, um, unfortunately, just eat anything and everything that they want, and possibly you're not getting any nutrition into your bodies. So everything that we teach has a nutritional value to it. You're going to love this tuna. And most of all, folks, just jump in your golf cart or come on down because uh, she's going to have this for you outside there in the community center, and you can actually taste it. I had the pleasure of tasting it before, and it is absolutely phenomenal. Okay, we're Ooh, gonna, and look what gonna she's going to add a in. little bit of uh, Himalayan sea salt. Um, you can use Celtic sea salt, but we do, again, avoid um, the traditional salts. We always go for sea salt, again, giving us more minerals, and a little bit of black pepper. And we're just going to mix that around. And you can serve this on crackers. You can serve it just on a bed of uh, greens. You can serve this on bread just like you would any tuna sandwich. And of course, we always recommend whole grain as far as crackers and breads go. And I am going to just let Franca, ooh, ooh. I moved the table. <laughs> oh, no, that is way too much. <laughs> And it's there just like that. It's ready. And oh my goodness, packed with nutrition. It's a powerhouse of nutrition, of high protein, high fiber, all your vitamins and minerals. Um, it, it helps to lower your cholesterol. It helps to lower your blood sugar. Uh, it, it's just um, everything in one little simple dish. Unbelievable. And look, it only took what? maybe seven or eight minutes to put it together That's correct. when you have all your ingredients mm -hmm. and as she does uh, mm -hmm. I have this wonderful a little container where she has chopped up everything <laughs> in advance and uh, she's able to prepare a meal in a very mm -hmm. quick time and the best part comes I mean I'm gonna have this you know I don't really you eat know. on, on when, when the camera goes off I'll, I'll maybe, that commercial, maybe. maybe that commercial no, no. the commercial <laughs> is that Nancy it's going to be here in our community at the cultural center in the craft room on Friday at two o'clock. Starting in May. On starting in May. On Fridays. And sh can you tell us a little bit more about your what, what uh, mm -hmm. your classes? 
what do you teach in your mm -hmm. class, what, what do you do, mm -hmm. what do you give them, what suggestion you mm -hmm. have for them, and you actually, you know, she brings mm -hmm. a stove, kind of sort of, a portable stove, and she does all the cooking there. So it's all yours, Nancy. Okay. While you're doing that, I am going to bite on mm -hmm. this. Okay. Well, we're going to change it just a little bit um, in, in uh, May. We're going to be teaching every Friday, and on Monday and Tuesday, the week prior to Friday, will be a pre-registration at the hostess desk. Um, you will need to pay in advance uh, for classes. And um, every Friday, we're going to have three dishes. We're going to do a breakfast dish, a lunch dish, and a dinner uh, meal. And we're going to change this every Friday so that if you miss one Friday, um, you'll still have a new recipe the next Friday. And, and you know, you'll be learning basically a whole cookbook full of ideas. Um, again, it's whole foods. Um, none of the recipes uh, contain meat, fish, dairy, or eggs. Um, you're going to be pleasantly surprised how flavorful everything is. And you're going to start to realize what food actually tastes like. Your taste buds are going to start to change. And you're going to, your body's going to tell you that it wants these nutrients. And, um, you know, unfortunately, meat, fish, dairy, and eggs has no nutrient value. They're, they're high in fat. They're high in cholesterol. The way we're cooking today is completely cholesterol free and every dish is cholesterol free. So the advantage is, of course, your cholesterol counts do go down. Um, another nice point to make when we cook this way, such as our vegan mayonnaise, is it's dairy free and egg free. So you don't have to worry about cross contamination with our foods, with meats, um, having um, meals with um, egg in it go bad because we don't you know, cook with that. Um, everything is whole food, so it's fresh, um, it, it's alive, is what I like to think of. And so I think you'll all enjoy it. Um, we have had some previous classes. Everyone is totally amazed at the way the food tastes. And it actually, you're going to find that you like it better than just having a piece of meat, potato, and, and a vegetable. You're going to be enjoying flavors from other countries. Um, you know, it's, it's just, you know, how to combine the foods. Um, enjoying it, you know, adding fruits to things, adding nuts and seeds, which we're not familiar with cooking. And I, I think you're really going to enjoy the classes and be pleasantly surprised. And we hope to see everyone there. But what does it do for your health? This is what really well, is amazing. You know, we don't like to make any claims, but when you eat plant-based foods, it changes your well-being. You'll have more energy. Um, you'll stop being tired, you'll sleep better at night. Um, you know, again, it, it happens fast. It, the, the food is so powerful. It, it becomes your medicine, basically. And it changes your body with, in a short amount of time. And in three to four weeks, you'll find that your cholesterol levels are going down. You'll find that your blood sugar is normalizing. Your blood pressure starts to normalize. And then, after that, it's all of these things that are going on inside your body that you can't even tell is happening. And you start to lose weight without even trying, you know. You, you'll start to, um, you just start to feel better. You, you feel energized. You know, I'm 65, my husband's 65, and we feel like we're back in our 20s again. It has energized us that much. I was 243 pounds. I've lost, oh, I've dropped down to 160, so I've lost about 60 pounds. And my husband's lost about 45 pounds. And, uh, you know, I, I had high cholesterol. I'm all back in normal ranges. Um, blood sugar is all back in normal ranges. It just happens very fast. And it's, you know, Hippocrates says, let thy food be thy medicine, let thy medicine be thy food. And that was way back in 460 BC. And somehow we've lost this through the years, you know, it, it's all processed foods, processed foods, processed foods, genetically modified foods. And so we take you away from all of this. Genetically modified foods are found in um, anything with corn or soy, which is in all our processed foods. You'll see corn oil on the ingredient list. You'll see soy oil on the ingredient list. And these are genetically modified oils from, from the soybeans and uh, you know, in the corn, and these are very detrimental to our health because genetically modified foods have not been approved uh, 
or disqualified from the FDA as being dangerous. And unfortunately, the company Monsanto has control of our seeds. And these seeds, corn and soy, uh, are sprayed with heavy toxins. Um, and these toxins are being eaten, of course, by our cattle and so forth and so on, and, and used in our products. And we are consuming these toxins. So we have to start you know, really thinking about what we're putting into our, our bodies. And it's, um, we hope to accomplish in our cooking classes showing you how easy it is to do this. And we just have to say no to these processed foods. We have to you know, rethink how we want to be healthy. And it, it's up to us. We have to take control of our health. It's not going to be government um, you know, telling us that we need to do this. I mean, we just have to think. We have to rethink, make good choices, and um, you're going to be so happy that you did. You're going to feel wonderful. And uh, um, how much are your classes, Nancy? Well, they, our classes will be $30, and the time will be from 2 o'clock to 4.30 in, in the afternoon. And um, again, we're going to be serving a breakfast, a lunch, and a dinner tasting. And uh, I know that you mm -hmm. give out coupons. You give we out give out recipes, coupons, yes. You, mm -hmm. you, you tell people uh, where to buy and uh, how to buy it. Yes. And uh, you even uh, suggest them when we go on Thursday down to the uh, uh, market, mm -hmm. uh, the the farmer's market. Farmer's market. Right. Oh, There's Gary the at the farmer's market who sells all organic produce and it's, um, he, he's the perfect place to go because he sells the green peppers, the red peppers, the cucumbers, the tomatoes, um, the fresh beans, um, zucchini, yellow squash. And you're going to find when you do whole food cooking that those are the ingredients that you'll be using in most recipes. And that's where you want to spend the majority of your grocery bill at the Whole Foods, at the, at the organic market. And Gary has um, offered to give a group discount to Good Samaritan Village, Gary Parks. And so if you all come down on the bus and tell them that you're from Good Samaritan Village and that Skip and Nancy Stein you know, sent you, um, he will work out you know, a, a comparable uh, price for all of the produce. But again, that's where you want to spend the bulk of your, your um, grocery bill is on uh, fruits, on vegetables, on greens. You can, when you think you've eaten some greens, then you need, need to eat five times more of the greens. Greens are very important. Um, we'll, we'll be teaching juicing, um, how to juice. We'll be teaching smoothies. We'll be teaching um, Asian cooking. We'll be teaching um, the benefits of a lot of Asian vegetables. We'll be teaching, um, Oh gosh, just about everything. You know, Italian cooking, we'll be teaching uh, Mexican cooking. Um, you know, it's just, it's so varied that you're never going to, you're not going to believe the powerhouse of, of different tastes and foods that you're going to just really enjoy eating. Wow. And uh, most of all, you know, uh, you may think, oh my goodness, it's so expensive to buy organic. But let me ask you something. How much do your medication cost? Mm -hmm. How Correct. much a prescription drug you use? You know, if we could just get rid of that by, you know, the old proverb, you are what you eat. Correct. Exactly. It's been there for a long, long yep. time. And, uh, but the knowledge, and I tell you, it, you know, I just ate that wonderful uh, mock tuna tasted exactly like tuna fish in a wonderful little, uh, <laughs> uh, wonderful bread. Yep, we just used uh, these little cocktail breads. Just absolutely phenomenal. Little cocktail breads. And please come on down. Nancy and her husband, Skip, are going to be outside here uh, on a table at the community center. Come and taste it. Come and smell the aroma of these wonderful herbs. And, um, you know, Staying healthy, uh, you know, we live a lot longer now, but the quality of life Correct. is up to us. And uh, the quality of life is, is really, you are what you eat. Okay, and I'm guilty, just like everybody else. I'm just a little too fluffy. I was guilty too. <laughs> Nancy was guilty too, but there's always time to reform. Yep, that's correct. And um, this is an amazing opportunity that we have 
Nancy and Skip to come in, in our village. And she has so many resources, so many wonderful uh, menu that she will give out to you and recipes that you can use and uh, how to become creative with our food. It's just like, it's phenomenal. I think it's worth every penny and she has given it to us at a great reduction because normally our classes run $70. Uh, at $30 is less, it is 55% is discount of right. the normal mm -hmm. class. Yeah. Uh, and it's here, you don't have to go somewhere in town to go and, and, and find them and to go there and drive and so on and so forth. It's right here, you can get on in your golf cart. But what it does to you, the, this learning experience, it will change your life. That's correct. And I know uh, her husband has a real true story to tell mm -hmm. that uh, how he conquered um, cancer, cancer. Mm -hmm. by just changing his diet. Changing his diet. Uh, absolutely phenomenal. So it's here for you. It's here for you to take advantage of. Um, I am so excited about the few things that I learned while I was running in and out just to check out what was going on and to listen to some of our residents that have gone before and have this very informal class at the very beginning. And by the way, there is one more uh, this coming Friday, correct? That, that's correct. I'm and those are, you know, is it, and, and then this is totally different than what she's going to do right. in May and it's mm -hmm. going to be in our calendar. But there have to be a minimum of 10 people. Mm -hmm. So please uh, wake up your senses and be very sensitive about what is she's doing and what she's going to teach you. Uh, you will be very surprised. You will become more energized and uh, I don't know, maybe psychosomatic. You know, I've your already skin will start to glow. Yes. You know, and, and just you'll see the transformation in your body. And, and, and uh, again, those who, you know, need to lose weight, you're just going to lose weight without even realizing it. And the great thing about it is when you lose the weight, you don't gain it back like all other uh, diets. Yes. Because all other diets are just that. They're diets. Plant-based nutrition is a lifestyle change. So it's not like, well, I lost a few pounds. I'm going to go back to eating the way I was. This is a lifestyle change. So once you, you're going to feel so good when you change your diet to eat this way that you won't want to go back the other way. Because when you do, and I've had many comments from people that have you know, cheated and gone back, and they'll say when they ate the meat, when they ate the fish, when they ate the eggs, they didn't feel good the next day. And so your body becomes, you know, it, it, it tells you, you know, and you'll be able to notice this um, better too. It, so it, it just... Listen to your listen body. Listen to your body, And um, this is just absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. And again, you're cordially invited to come and uh, have a little tidbits of this and that. You know what is the best part is? That you eat some and it's not a huge amount and you feel satisfied. Full. You're full faster. That's correct. And uh, mm -hmm. you feel satisfied. Yeah. And, you know, it, it is amazing. Well, I, I was only eating six ounces of something that it was processed. I can eat two ounces of that and feel completely happy and satisfied. And that's another good point, Franca, because, you know, again, when you eat this way, you're going to find you're not hungry in between meals. You lose your craving for sugar. You lose your craving for all those little fast foods that you were used to eating during the day, and and you're satisfied. Your body is is full. It it says I I'm full, and uh, you're going to notice a big difference just in in eating in between meals and so forth. It's going to just be totally amazing. Fantastic, Nancy. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you and for having again, me. And again, uh, if you like to come down. Please do so. She's going to be here for the next half hour, 45 minutes, yes. whatever she decides to have. And uh, uh, you can sign up at the hostess desk uh, for her classes. I have a schedule that, that, that tells you exactly what she is going to offer to you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and so on and so forth. And, you know, I leave you with this thought. You know, you are very important. And what you can do for yourself, especially with this food, is going to be crucial for you to stay healthy and happy and enjoy life. And with that, enjoy life. I see you tomorrow. Ciao, arrivederci.